Jeff Fischel here at the ACC Digital Network with the king of college <laughs> basketball, J.R. Reed, former UNC great. I'm pronouncing you king of college basketball, so you can give us your take on what you see in all of college basketball right now. So the first thing, the NCAA tournament, as king of college basketball, how many teams would you like to see in the dance? Well, Jeff, I would like to go back to 64 teams that we used to have. I, mean, I, I, I get it. I understand the NCAA is motivated by money and teams jumping conferences for money. But I'm a historian of the game. I grew up watching this ACC conference. And I remember Terry Hall and Dean Smiths and uh, Lefty Giselle's battle. And I'd like to see the conference try to stay intact, especially with a lot of the North Carolina teams in there if possible. Okay, so we've seen the tournament grow. 32, you know, 48, 53, 54, at one point now 64, but you want it to be done. You want it, now it's even added those Tuesday games. You don't like those. No, I want it to, you leave it all on the court. I think that's the way it should be, Jeff. I think you should go out there, play your, 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 your competition, your schedule, and leave it up to the NCAA to decide. I understand, too, about their early games of teams playing, trying to get into the tournament, but I like it the way that it was. The 64 best. Okay, now another thing we've seen change over the year is guys leaving earlier and earlier. The NCAA now has a one-and-done rule before they go to the, uh, to the NBA. What do you think of the one-and-done rule? Uh, stop it. I don't, <laughs> yeah, I'm not a fan, and I'm, and I'm sure David Stern is not a fan of it either. He would like to see NBA guys, I mean college players, stand in school for at least two years. I'd like to see him for three years because I feel you don't haven't been coached. You don't know enough about the game. It was no way that I could have been ready myself my freshman year going into the NBA. I like to see the schools have an opportunity to develop these guys and give them a chance to develop into the players that they can be. I know the money's good, but wait, it'll be, it gets greater later. So you don't feel like it cost you a couple of years of earning power to <laughs> stay in school for three years at NC? The only thing that could have helped me is maybe going to a different team. I got a chance to go to Charlotte Hornets, which was expansion, which means we were terrible. Right. We were horrible. So maybe I could have come in and gone to a veteran team or something that would have helped me. But I think these guys need the maturity level, especially in the basketball court. Today. What about Kobe, LeBron, Dwight Howard? These guys go right into the league and they dominate. That's three. Okay. Now, there's the other 40 that you didn't mention that, right. that did the one and done and didn't make it. But it's a tough league. It's a man's league. And, and a lot of guys aren't prepared for life after or off the court. And they might be prepared for it on the court, but there's so many different dimensions to it. So if you were king, you'd want at least two years. At least two, but I would squeeze to try to get three. Okay, all right. Now, if you were king, you'd also have a control of the athlete, ACC, right? The Atlanta Coast Conference. What would you like to see as an ACC fan? What I would like to see, I would just like to see, as I mentioned, I can touch on again, the conference stand intact. I think we've got a rich history of ACC basketball going back for decades. And I just like to see the same teams, NC State, against Carolina, against Duke. I just think we have so much to offer and so much talent here in this conference. There's nothing like some of those rivalries in the conference games. You can't beat them. Even with the new teams coming in next year, it's still not going to take away from the Duke, Carolina, NC State, Carolina rivalries. Right. He's J.R. Reed. I'm Jeff Fischel. You're watching the ACC Digital Network brought to you by Ruby Tuesday.